being a painter and a skateboarder at the same time is kind of like expressing one's uh, individual self when you feel yourself as like such an individual to the point where anything you do, you have your own style. Skateboarding is so that. You know? <laughs> if you ever say, did you see Stevie Williams kickflip? Everybody knows how to kickflip. But when you see Stevie Williams kickflip, you're just like, oh, it's butter, it's butter. It's beautiful, it's art, it's his, period. When you say that's a Picasso or that's a Monet or that's a Lee West, you know, it's a certain style that when other artists start to take on my style, people can be like, oh yeah, this guy he paints and it's kind of like a Lee West kind of way. But you know, it's their own thing, but you know, you can see like the influence of Lee West in this thing, you know? Well, when I paint these, I paint a lot of skaters that are, if you see for the most part, their faces are confident. Sometimes they don't even have faces, but they have uh, stances of comfortability. I want to paint all of my skaters looking like they're doing some depth-defying shit, but they're comfortable in that moment. The fear under such pressure, under such fear of like, you know, what could happen bad. All you're focused on is how good it's gonna feel when you do land it. It's all about confidence. In life, you're gonna be put through a lot of shit that's gonna be scary. And your what if could freak you out so bad that you could fall just by like, what if? But if you're just like, but what if? <laughs> what if I do pull this shit off? That's enough to kind of smile about. <laughs>